I'm formerly from Omaha, Nebraska. And I have a question. Some time ago I read that they were buying, you were buying silver. I never knew the reason why you were buying silver. Well, we covered the silver purchase in the 1997 annual report for a special reason. Well, we, A, it was part of a group of three unconventional investments we made, and one of those investments was of sufficient size so that we felt people ought to know about it specifically. And then we felt our shareholders ought to know that we sometimes do things uh, that they might not have guessed that we would do from reading past annual reports, so we named the three unconventional investments. But in this year's report, we have stated that we will not be naming those investments unless one of two things happens. One is that they become of a size that you should know about them specifically in order to evaluate the kind of thing we do in, in Berkshire and, and the, the commitment of resources that has been made. Or two, if regulatory authorities either, obviously if they require us to report it, we'll, we'll report it immediately. Or in the case of silver, a year plus ago, uh, an important regulatory authority indicated they would have pre that they prefer if we report it. We weren't required to do so, but, but and our desire is to cooperate on that anyway, so we, we did report it. But we stated in this year's report that absent those factors, we will not be giving details on unconventional investments any more than we give any more details on our, our regular equity holdings than, than we're more or less required uh, to do. We did say that we had changed certain of the unconventional and con investments that were described in the, in the previous year's report, and we stated that we had entered into several new ones. So we are in some things that most of you or maybe all of you don't know about, but they aren't of sufficient size so that they're going to, in any material way at all, affect your investment. Charlie? Uh, nothing to add.